Tonight, the category is me. Gentlemen, start your engines, and may the best woman win. Now, sissy that wow. First up, Jocelyn Fox. Yes, mama. Serving slit. Girl, why it gotta be black? I'm serving evening glam RuPaul. I'm feeling fabulous, fishy, and fierce. I like the little swivel she does with the, her arms. I think Heather should just pass gas. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, Gia Gunn. Bitch stole your look. That's my dress. <laughs> I'm serving my RuPaul gown that is very iconic, and I'm eating it up. And this is the bag. Mm. I love a nude illusion. Dip into the waters of Darien Lake. Mm. Oh, wow. The masquerade ball. Yes, all star. I'm giving RuPaul my version of her runway walk as Gertha Kid. Eyes wide shut, yes. legs wide open. <laughs> <laughs> Laganja Estranja. Uh oh. Ooh, welcome to my stratosphere. Fembots have feelings too. <laughs> <laughs> I am serving season four Starcher Engines Mama Roo. And I'm feeling it, girl. I'm plummeting the runway and dropping it like it's hot. Such a good body. I wish her hair was fuller. What? That's the you only thing. <laughs> <laughs> Bianca Del Rio, cover girl. Looking good, feeling gorgeous. I am serving age appropriate Rue. I'm giving Rue realness now, and I'm feeling good. She sparkles just like a Cable Ace Award. <laughs> Adore Delano. Glamazon. Superstar. What I'm doing is Adore Delano, inspired by RuPaul and I'm showing my brand new cinched ways. I look cool. She's cinched for the gods. Work that body, work that body. <laughs> <laughs> Trinity K. Bonet, foxy lady out of sight. Get your rebel on, girl. I am serving an illusion of RuPaul, and I look absolutely amazing. Birds of a feather. I didn't know the birds came in that color. <laughs> work it, mama, work. Up next, Ben de la Creme. Wait a minute, that is my dress. <laughs> I'm giving some contemporary RuPaul. I'm working that runway, I feel great in my dress. This is like identity theft. First she steals Michelle's identity, now she steals mine. You'll be hearing from my lawyer. <laughs> Thunder from down under. Caught in the act. Oh. oh my goodness. I mean, the legs are the best legs I've ever seen in my life. Oh, wait, hold up now. Uh -huh. Wait a minute. Besides, you. Besides you. I am possessed by the spirit of RuPaul, and I can hear Ru's voice in my head saying, Supermodel of the world. I wore this outfit to the VH1 Fashion Awards. Yes, you did. Bob Mackey. Mel. Hello, hello, hello! It's Workroom Roo. No one has ever seen this on the runway. I am working my ascot off. Is that a Klein Epstein Parker suit? Lady looks like a dude. Now, sissy that wow. Tonight, my girls are ready to take a bow because, bitch, they're Madonna. Gentlemen, start your engines and may the best woman win. Thorgy Thor. Crouching Tiger, Hidden Drag Queen. Nothing really matters. No, sure doesn't. As I'm walking down the runway, I'm giving you like angular, interesting, artistic movements, and I'm feeling it. Undercover Geisha. Oh, kimono, she better don't. Up next, Kim Chi. Oh. Two in a row. I have a gorgeous vintage wedding kimono, but I wish I wasn't wearing the same thing as Thorgy. She's serving that walk, Michelle. She is. W-O-K. Yeah. W -O -K. yeah. <laughs> Derek Barry, nothing really matters. The remix. Yes. I'm walking down in the most original kimono. It's hand painted, and I feel like this is a standout piece. Is that sidewalk talk? John Paul Goatee, yeah, 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 yeah. Naomi Smalls. Oh, again. 
Yeah, these guys are really hung up on kimonos. <laughs> I didn't think anybody else was going to choose kimono Madonna. I'm trying to own this even though three other girls are in the exact same look. Kung Fu fighting. This is like the Victoria's Secret section of Madonna. Uh, I like that material, girl. <laughs> Acid Betty. She's keeping her baby. It may have a few holes in it, but. <laughs> My Madonna look today is from Bedtime Stories, where she's pregnant, giving birth to doves. This outfit represents who I am, because obviously I'm the only one created enough to think of it. I think she just flipped us the bird. Bye bye, birdie. Robbie Turner. She's in a league of her own. There's no crying in baseball, Robbie. I feel so cute. I got my cute little dress. So it's all hand painted with my little patches. I wonder if she's a pitcher or a catcher. Me too. Chi Chi Devane. You're gonna poke somebody's eyes out with those things. <laughs> if you're lucky. When you think of Madonna, you think of the cone bra. Bitch, I look good. Oh yeah, she's totally expressing herself. I think she likes a little hanky panky. Bob the drag queen. Oh. oh. Not to be confused with Bob the camp counselor. I love. My favorite Madonna look is Madonna at the Glad Awards, and she's dressed like a Boy Scout. And it is a huge political statement. And I'm not in a kimono. Get a load of those Girl Scout <laughs> cookies. Yes. And she earned a badge for walking children in nature. Yes. Our contestants return to the stage wearing their very best Lady Gaga drag. First up, Peppermint, Grammy Awards 2016. If it ain't brocade, don't fix it. <laughs> Ground control to Major Tom giving you Gaga, Bowie, realness. Because the entire point of drag is to give the middle finger to rules of gender. I have nothing to say. I'm going to be speechless this whole time. <laughs> it's OK. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. <laughs> Next up, Valentina, the CFDA Awards. That was New Glare when Nicola Formichetti was there. I am wearing the look she wore for the CFDA Awards. I definitely see myself a bit in Lady Gaga because she carries herself with grace and glamour, but I always want to add Valentina flair to what I do. I brought my sister as my date, and we were both on the red carpet like a bunch of pissed off New Yorkers. <laughs> <laughs> Some things never change, darling. <laughs> Paparazzi love her. Next up, Eureka, the telephone video. Yes! Guilty as charged. <laughs> I decided to do the telephone look. I just want to give them something big and glamorous and kind of risky couture. Got my titties on my chin. Cinch, pull, and tuck, honey. That's the D. Great choice, darling. I believe that was Jean de Castel who made that garment. Oh, you say that to all the queens. <laughs> <laughs> Next up, Charlie Hyde's Brit Awards 2010. That's a lace front wig, I believe. I believe it is. <laughs> yes. I've chosen to wear the outfit that Lady Gaga wore for the 2010 Brit Awards. I've done Lady Gaga hundreds of times on YouTube, and I think I'm pretty polished, so I'm fairly confident. Philip Tracy made this for McQueen, and he gave it to me because I was doing a tribute to him. Don't be a drag. Be a McQueen. Next up, Pheromone, the Alejandro video. Pray and slay. Oh my god, look at her cross. I look exactly like Lady Gaga in my Alejandro music video look. And I'm rocking my real hair. And I really hope that Lady Gaga lives for it. The attitude in the face is really good. And the makeup is on point. Because Steven Klein and I had an argument about it. I thought it was too much makeup in this scene. Don't cross this queen. Everybody needs a virgin to sacrifice. Can I get an amen? Next up, Sasha Velour, the applause video. Do I have something on my face? <laughs> I'm wearing my favorite look that she has ever done. A Pierrot clown, high art, Pat McGrath makeup. It is the place where art and pop meet. It's going to be hard for this not to be one of my favorites. What do you live for, Gaga? The applause. <laughs> Painted for the Gaga. <laughs> Alexis Michelle, the Golden Globes. Best actress realness. When I saw Gaga at the Golden Globes in this gown, I said, she's wearing Alexis Michelle's body. So here I am, body, curb, swerve, and trophies. Yay! 
Donatella Versace made this for me. That is not easy to make that bodice that way. Wonderful job, darling, and thank you for bringing my globe with you. <laughs> it's Versace. <laughs> <laughs> Snatching trophy. Shea Coulee Monster Ball Tour. Pause up, baby. My Lady Gaga look, it's ethereal, powerful, yet gentle and serene, and it mixes engineering and fashion. This reminds me of the film that Nick Knight did with the yellow electric uh, urine blonde. Mm. Mm. Urine blonde is my screen name on Scruff. It is. <laughs> yes. It's my password on Netflix. <laughs> Trinity Taylor, American Horror Story Hotel. Yes, Countess. <laughs> yes. This look speaks to me because I love darkness and glamour and vampires. And Lady Gaga was so seductive and sexy and brilliant in the show. Trinity, a little club soda will take that right out. <laughs> you know, they say that if you use your own spit, the enzymes break down the blood. So Good to know. Thank you. This competition is cutthroat. Kimora Black. Lady Gaga on the go. This is the Versace phase. I'm giving a look that Gaga wears to like the airport. I think picking out what she's done for red carpets is so predictable and it's so like, all right, done. Those boots, they remind me of the pleasers that I used to get off of um, Hollywood Boulevard, eh, Annie? Yep. yep. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Uh -uh. No, ma'am. James Mansfield, the cover of Vogue. Oh. I am serving you Gaga on the cover of Vogue. My drag is campy and different, so I'm giving you Lady Gaga in Slumberland. I look amazing, and if they don't like this dress, don't blame me, blame Marc Jacobs. Oh, she's a little sleepy. It's Marc Jacobs, she's Markleptic. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> she's actually not wrong either, because I was so tired the day that we did that shoot that that's probably what I look like in between shots. Well, <laughs> cover girl, put some gel in your hair. Nina Bonina Brown. VMAs 2009. Oh my God. Yes, McQueen, yeah. This was one of the biggest nights of my life. I'm serving you the black version of Lady Gaga. A lot of hips, a lot of ass, and a lot of sass. I can't see how Lady Gaga is reacting because I can't see anybody. I just love the expression in her face when she wears this outfit. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you yeah. can tell she's happy. Oh, now she's on the edge of hoary. Up next, Aja, comme des garçons. Now, where did I park my car? <laughs> For my Lady Gaga look, I'm wearing a remake of her Comme des Garçons look that she wore to show that beauty has no shape. You know, I wore this because <laughs> the media was saying I was fat and I knew this archive, so I called Comme des Garçons and I asked them if we could wear it. It's such an excellent choice. And very slimming. It's all about the waist. Oika felt. <laughs> <laughs> Tonight, category is Night of a Thousand Madonnas, the sequel. Gentlemen, start your engines and may the best woman win. Category is Aja. Last night she dreamt of San Pedro, or Del Taco, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> yes. I'm just showing off my little ruffles. I feel like I should have came up with some castanets. <laughs> la is la boniva. <laughs> Alexis Michelle as Breathless Mahoney. More like Breathless Mahoney. <laughs> I love my shape. I love the sequin. I'm breathless. Has anyone seen Dick? Who? Tracy. Oh, my bottom hurts just thinking about it. <laughs> Peppermint. Experience has made her a rich bitch. Trying to buy our votes. This is probably my favorite Madonna video. And this gorgeous woman being surrounded by all these guys. It's my dream. Talk to me, Harry Winston. <laughs> Shea Coulee, material girl. Deja vu. I think she stole that look. Oh, she certainly <laughs> did. This is the second wife, the one that gets all the money and the diamonds and the furs. You know, the good good. Drag queens really do prefer blondes. <laughs> Trinity Taylor. Ooh. Givon, she better do. <laughs> My Madonna is the only Madonna. I feel like a very strong, powerful bitch right now. It's a pants suit without the pants. Who needs pants when you have all this ass? Nina Bonina Brown, Louise Ciccone. I think I've met this one before. Who wore it better? Mm, we'll find out. 
right now I'm just trying to serve a black version of Madonna, even though they just seen this outfit. Don't get mad, get plaid. <laughs> <laughs> Sasha Velour. Oh. Her name is Dita, and she will be your mistress. Nice grill. <laughs> this is very much the type of Madonna look that has inspired me and my style. And I'm really excited to show that I can walk like a fashion model. Put your hands all over her body. <laughs> Pheromone Cleopatra. Wow. My Madonna is probably the best one here. Every detail is on point. Well, this Super Bowl look is a home run. <laughs> Aren't you mixing you need metaphors? You a touchdown? <laughs> Santi Ali Fontaine. Uh-oh. <laughs> Olé. Not adorable. <laughs> Nobody's wearing my look. Ooh, the Lord, Santo Dios, Padre de la Gloria, thank you. I think she lost her bull. <laughs> Valentina. Oh. Mm. oh. You know, I hate censorship. Me too. <laughs> When Madonna came out with this book, it was so controversial. And showing this much of my body is controversial, too. I'll walk out the way I walked in, naked. <laughs> <laughs> Category is Queen Elizabeth Realness. First up, Crystal. Welcome to Tuckingham Palace. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm giving you military dominatrix. I'm gonna crush you with my colonial might. There is so much detail in this jacket. The epaulettes, the medals are actual replicas, the feather in the hat, the patch, everything is thought through. And I'm feeling fierce and in control. I can see her Prince Albert from here. <laughs> Cheryl Hole. I'm getting a royal flush. Ooh. <laughs> I am serving Queen Liz going to a royal function. It's a little understated, but still classy. I put my own Cheryl spin on it and added the touch of pearls down the trim just to give it a little zhuzh up. Move over, Olivia Coleman. There's a new queen in town. She takes the man out of Olivia Coleman. <laughs> <laughs> Something wrong. She's really putting her stamp on this competition. I've decided to go as the iconic first class stamp. I am walking down the runway in a cage of foam and cardboard. Uh, I think she's being profiled. <laughs> <laughs> stamp, stamp, stamp. Lick me. The royal wave. Ooh. Blue hydrangea. Rue, she's so thin, she weighs just about a pound. <laughs> <laughs> I am serving you Queen Elizabeth money. This is a handmade dress giving you bronze, silver, and I'm going to take the gold. Lift that any higher, I can see her tuppence. You can. <laughs> I'm taking Queen Elizabeth, and I'm making her Instagram ready. The Queen doesn't need to carry money, but if she did, she'd be carrying me in her coin purse. She must have a splitting headache. <laughs> Bag of chips. Everything's coming up roses. I am serving late 70s, early 80s, Queen Elizabeth realness. I am loving my pink flowers. I look half Queen Elizabeth, half Dumbridge from Harry Potter. Bow down to your queen! Oh, queenie. Oh, Filthy no. queen. The Vivian. Are you mucking kidding me? I'm giving you Queen Elizabeth walking round Balmoral, and she's caught a few ducks out there as well. Of course she's wearing wellies. Granny tights, a little plaid skirt, poncho, headscarf. I am just living for this look. It must be a mistake. I think this is George Washington. <laughs> <laughs> You're a duck in disgrace. Vinegar strokes. Now that is the biggest pearl necklace I've ever seen. <laughs> really? Yeah, <laughs> trust me. I'm serving 70s summer elegance in this gorgeous yellow polka dot caftan with a turban to match. The Queen would have worn this in one of her royal world tours visiting Africa and the Middle East. I feel fabulous. Is Kaftanistan part of the Commonwealth? Yes, yes it is. Oh, good. Gothy Kendall. She's crowning. <laughs> Someone had to say it. The look that I am serving is fresh, young, 1950s Queen Elizabeth. I am giving you regal realness, waving to all my royal subjects. And I'm sure Queen Elizabeth has a few fishnet tights that are stoned. She's so sashy. Yeah, yes. she's so sashy. Scaredy Cat. 
Oh. oh, don't be a dummy. I am serving you pissed off princess baby realness. I need my beauty sleep and I'm royally off. Looks like somebody missed a royal nap. Oh! I am the ultra baby queen of the competition and the queen was once a baby, so it makes sense. Mummy always loved Margaret better. <laughs> <laughs> Davina de Campo. Regal housewives of Britannia. <laughs> <laughs> My inspiration was the star in the garter. I am feeling poised, like I'm gliding on air, and I'm trying to be as regal as possible. And just so that you know, I really am wearing a garter. This is less Dame Helen Mirren and more Dame Helen Mirren. Wow. <laughs> Night of a Thousand Michelle Visages, a.k.a. Joyce Leslie on Parade. <laughs> First up, Jan in Glamazonian Airways, Michelle. <laughs> yeah. Wow, she looks hot. Fly me to the moon. Come on, Tits McGee. <laughs> Jackie Cox in All Stars, oh. Michelle Trapp. Yes, oh my gosh, she the lightning bolt ring. Representing yeah. South Plainfield, New Jersey, Gigi Good, Soul System, Michelle. Done it. My body looked just like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nailed it. Britta, season 10 finale, Michelle. <laughs> Who's that behind those foster grands? Oh, that's Michelle Visage. Yes! Jada Essence Hall, all stars icon, Michelle. <laughs> like Coco Chanel said, when leaving the house, take one thing off. In my case, it was my shirt. <laughs> Crystal Method. Oh, here we go. RuPaul show, Lady in Red, Michelle. 1996, Ru. Yeah, it's just like yesterday. The Widow Von Du. RuPaul show, Starry, Starry Michelle. Love this red, white, and blue. That's when Michelle was trying to join the Spice Girls as Old Spice. <laughs> <laughs> Heidi on the set of TOWIE, Michelle. Oh, my God. Michelle's huge in the UK. Or at least her bun is. My bun's always huge. <laughs> <laughs> Category is Night of a Thousand Celines. Gentlemen, start your engines and may the best woman win. <laughs> Fringe, fringe, fringe across the board. This look is inspired by Celine at the Met Gala. I am serving car wash realness in this gorgeous feather headpiece and this almost floor length fringe. Do you need a wash? Full service, honey. No headdress for the wicked. Shave your armpits. <laughs> Next up, Scarlet Bobo. Poof, there it is. Satiner, I don't even know her. <laughs> I'm wandering Celine Dion with my Paris Fashion Week little bedtime eleganza. Oh, it's so hard to get out of bed. <laughs> Just take it with you. <laughs> I'm serving you soft face, this cute little bun, this elegant off-the-shoulder dress. I'm like, oh, look at my glittery collar buttons. Kiara. Ruffles, all dressed, bitch. A new gay has come. Tonight, the fantasy is Celine album release realness. I am serving legs on the runway. I'm serving ruffles. I'm feeling sexy in this ponytail. A French exit. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. <laughs> Rita Vega. I will sell this house today. <laughs> <laughs> the inspiration is Celine before and after the fame. I'm serving you 80s ugly realness and ooh, a little reveal. Oh. She's wearing a black sequence dress. She looks lovely. Her heart does go on and on oh, and man. on. She's strutting, she's walking, she's goofing all around, just like the Celine we know. Oh, the duck walk of shame, I know it well. Jimbo. Oh. Oh. I am inspired by Celine Dion Paris Fashion Week. Drill Sergeant Celine Dion. Drive all night and drop and give me 20. <laughs> I am sparkling from head to toe, showing off my rhinestone glasses, my rhinestone shoulders. I've just escaped from Celine Dion boot camp, and I'm here to serve you fashion. Are those shoulders the Dion quintuplets? <laughs> <laughs> Next is Lemon. I am serving you her 1998 Oscars performance where she won an Oscar. Queer, far, wherever you are. <laughs> I feel gorgeous in this dress, and I feel like I'm the heart of the ocean. Didn't the old lady drop it in the ocean in the end? Well, baby, I went down and got it for you. <laughs> 
Next up, Ilona Burley. I'm doing Celine Dion and Elsa Chaparelli 2017. I want to show the judges that I can walk in an actual heel. I'm giving you find the life alert because I'm about to drop dead in these f***ing shoes. My EKG machine just says slut. She's rhinestone, she's glistening, she's letting the judges have it. Is she wearing a life jacket on her bottom? <laughs> and Priyanka. Oh, here comes the bride. Oh! Look at this wedding dress. It is the exact replica of the one she wore. She's father and the bride. And shablam, there's another dress out of the wedding dress. I am serving her icon award dress. Thank you so much. Thank you and good night. Do you want everything RuPaul's Drag Race at your fingertips? Then head over to YouTube now and subscribe to the RuPaul's Drag Race channel. And you will get all the episodes of everything you ever want, including brand new episodes of Whatcha Packin'. Hi.